Good afternoon, students. I hope all of them good not bad. Uh, today, talk about email, uh, second course, and listen one. If you remember, last lecture, talk about what? Talk about the emails. The email is a method of composing, sending, and source receiving message, okay? And over uh, communications system. And the email, we have some ways, the formal and informal. But today, on the listen one, second course, talk about what? Talk about how to write emails. How to write emails. Uh, the last lecture, talk about the ways of email, formal and informal. But today, details talk about formal and informal. Look, we have some pointers, symbol and solutions, okay? Symbols, we have the some Point is simple. Normal and standard is always possible. And particularly friendly and respectively informal. When this, when this write down emails, you must be what? You must be this, uh, this location and this place, what? Place, government, place, university, institute, company, office, etc. You must be what? You must be formal write down email, not informal. Because what? Because this place, this place formal, government, university, and uh, office, etc. Look, particularly formal, rather use it in business letter or faxes. When we have two business, okay? When uh, first business write down email, must be what? Must be write down email formal, not informal, right? And the second solution, okay? Solution, uh, the second talk about what? Talk about when you write down emails, the subject and the topic. At the beginning, write down emails. You must be write down what? Write down dear Janet. When you write down email formal, you must be write down dear, okay? Because what? Because this email formal, not informal. After talk about informal emails, okay? Look, dear Janet, this is still normal and nice use it. Because you use dear Janet, okay? The person Janet, use what? Dear, okay? This email, inf informal emails. And hi, and Janet, okay? For a friend, this, okay? Some people use this. It is a bit short. We think, hello, Janet. It's not really English. When you write down email, hi, and Janet, okay? This email, what? This email, informal. Because what? Because the subject and this topic, you cannot use dear, okay? Not formal. Okay, this email formal, write down hi or Janet, okay? Any persons you can, you can write down emails. British people sometimes use a comma, okay? Look, dear Janet and Janet. Person people write down between persons, write down what? Write down comma, right? Not full thought, not uh, semicolon, okay? And look, look students, dear all, every can use a comma or a colon. Look, semicolon, okay? So do anything you want. American persons, when you write down email between words, write down what? Write down semicolon, okay? Not comma, right? Look at semicolon. It's nice, look, it's nice if you write down to several people together and one uh, more possibility, nothing, not the uh, no name, just a star, the message. This point mean what? Meaning, meaning write down email, informal emails, you cannot and you don't need, you don't need uh, write down name persons, okay? Uh -huh. Nothing and not dear, you cannot write down dear, see, okay? Not dear or not name, you cannot and you don't, you can't uh, need to write down names. It is not friendly. Throw maybe do this for simple answers to simple questions. When you 
send email your friends or any persons when you answer this email. You must write down simple answer or summarize an uh, answer. You cannot more details answer, right? Uh, another point, finish point, thank you, okay? When for both formal or informal, finish it email, write down, you must be what? When you answer this email, write down what? Thank you, okay? Thanks for, thanks for what? This information, okay? This, and you write down your comments for email, good or bad. You must be, when you write down, write down comment or information. Another something is, you must be summarize words, okay, for take time. If you uh, must be half time, you must be write down summarize, okay, not detail. Thank you for your letter of 12th June, your work on the project, okay. This was way of saying, we have received your letter. When you, your emails receive it, okay, when you answer, yes, yes, of course, uh, your email receive it, okay? You don't need to do this with emails, but it is still nice to begin by. Thanks for something if you can. And the finish and uh, the end, but thanks for your emails, a bit of a waste of time. At the end, uh, this lesson, I hope all of them understood this lesson, and I hope to be successfully and good bash at the end, goodbye.